Um, so you were asking about Joe. He's well. That's why, you know, I I I I don't always know what Joe's thinking, where he's coming from. I talk. I try to talk to him. You know, originally we were going to talk about our our dinner with Joe. Right. I think we're still trying to nail down that date. I don't know what you. How do you want to think about the dinner? What we want to say to Joe? Because I I can't give you any insight. I I really can't. Mm -hmm. I met with Hooker not that long ago, and we'll get back to that. Uh, but um, the uh, contract with Jay Doherty is under the CEO's budget. I never had to touch it. Mm -hmm. Now, someone needs to talk to Joe about it. I don't know how, you know, Joe's, I don't know how he's going to react. And um, here's what, I don't did John tell you he and I talked about it? Okay. So John, he, he suggested that I have a write-up for each of uh, Jay's subcontractors. Nice. Um, Zalewski and... Um, Olivo, and have them write up what they do. I'm like, I don't know what they do. I don't know if I can tell Joe what they do. <coughs> and you know, Joe's got to prove it. I, he's got to prove it. He's gonna want to know what's. Did, Joe, has Joe asked for you to do something in writing. This is what John suggested. Yeah. I haven't met with Joe on it. Okay, that's what I thought. I have not met with Joe on it, but I know Jay is hot to trot. Um, his assistant called in last week. I said we're working on it. Uh, so they're hot to trot on it, Mike. But sooner or later, uh, it's Joe's got to... Hey, Joe, by the way, here's his contract under your budget. Here's what it is. And he's going to ask questions. I just don't know how he'll react. Because I could see him saying, what? No. We're, money's better spent doing something else. Hiring Liz Brown. I don't know. Um, that's the, uh, I just don't know how he'll react to that. I don't either. <clears throat> and he could he just easily require something in writing, but um, I would say to you, don't what, put anything in writing. Okay, well, could, that, that was John's suggestion, yeah. all right? But my my dilemma is I got to go in to Joe and say, here's, this is under your budget, here's Jay's contract. He's going to say, well, how much is this for? What's all included? Please. What's what? What are we paying Jay for? So um, they're all you know, former board committee men and aldermen, Zuluski, <laughs> former alderman Olivo, and. Uh, this either was number one, two, or three, depending on the uh, year. His best uh, precinct worker. We actually trains other precinct workers. So, meaning, mean nice. Nice. Okay. <clears throat> so he's um, three quarters of the class. So it's a, it's a favor, and it's a, a Doherty for contract. It's a Doherty. So I'm asked to has to prove. If, if the IRS ever comes in and says, who are these guys and what do they do? Right. Doherty's got to prove it. Right. The company doesn't have to. Right. But I, I, I understand that. But Joe is going to, and legitimately so. I think it's a legitimate question. It is. Yeah. It's a legitimate question. Joe is going to ask, what are we paying Doherty for? But on Doherty's, for Doherty's sake, he does work for us. Right, but I'm just talking because, 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 because. about the three contracts. Well, if you look at the, if you look at the contract, it's Jay Doherty and Associates, and I forget the amount 
Mike, yeah. but it's a monthly amount right. equal to a yearly amount, and it's a pretty hefty amount. Okay, and then and then whatever, and and, and then what Jay's is. <coughs> Yeah, I can't remember. I don't. I don't know never, the numbers never, offhand. I've never asked him, but probably ten grand a month at least. Yeah, I don't remember offhand. So that's two six. That's two eighty-eight. If it's ten grand a month. And he goes, "What? Do you want me to talk to Joe? Um, I mean, you can, but." This is like company process business, Mike, right. and it kind of seems yeah. out of inappropriate. Inappropriate. Just trying to figure out best way to approach him to do that, because his reaction, I, I, quite frankly, I don't know how he react. I just don't think he'll react well, because just the way Joe is. If that, if that power. He's got his ex-prosecutor hat on. He's going to say, hey, we can't do this. That's right. That's a possibility. And he, in his conversations with his staff, he brings that up often. Former prosecutor, former prosecutor, former prosecutor. So I thought about this. That okay. That's very possible. That that's what his reaction is going to be. <clears throat> and um, obviously, you did not. Then I think you have to, or at, at least I'd, I'd ask you to recommend, like before you do anything, uh, Kim McLean and you have a, a sit down. Okay. As a backup. Okay. And, and, and you could say, look, I didn't think it was appropriate for McLean to I don't talk even, to you about I don't even want to bring that you're, up. You're welcome to. Yeah. Well, Joe is funny about conversations you and I might have that he's not aware of. And, 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 and Joe will probably believe that somehow we're plotting against him. Oh, he probably thinks that all the time. Well, but that's what I mean. I mean, and this will give him another nail in the coffin. So I, that's why, that's why I don't want to do that. So I recommend. Nothing in writing. I think all that can do is hurt you. There's no way you could, except for giving your bi biography. Can I wrap this up for you? You know what? I'm, I'm not going to take it. It's fine. Are you still picking at it? No, I'm done. All right. One more piece. No, God, no. It was, do you want to take it? No. You sure? <laughs> no, please. It's stop. very good. That's the problem. <laughs> um, except for maybe giving a biography of each of the three. <laughs> But I certainly wouldn't do the work product because you, you don't supervise that. I don't. Or monitor that. That's Jay's. Jay's. Right. Well, I still think I've got it. I'm not good at that. Uh, you know, but I would say this. Joe is saying your name, Brad. Jay's been really good to us at City Hall. And he does that. Uh, City Club. City Club. And so it's. Uh, and he, he, every, I'd say almost every speech that I've been at around, he posts comments. Sooner or later, he sneaks it in. Right. <laughs> Uh, shamelessly. Yeah, shamelessly. So there's a lot of benefit. Yeah. Guys, yeah. In my opinion. So then, what do you think about? All right, I'll I'll try that with Joe. Because here's this. Here's what's going on. You don't know what Joe Dominguez will show up that day. That's the problem. I know. Now you know better than I do. I know. I never know. And I don't have a litmus test to find out. Right. It was like, mm, I better come back tomorrow. So I could see him saying, we can't do this. Yep. 
okay, I mean, Fidel, we can't do this. I, I, Anne may have done that, but I don't feel good about this. Um, it, 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 it looks raw to me. I can I see him saying, yeah. well, or I can hear it, I can hear him saying, that's fine. I, I, I don't think you'll get to fine right away. No. But it's, I'm, I'm, it's, it's weird here when he approves this Liz Brown thing just shocked me, pissed me off, pissed me off at Liz. She's so dumb. So this is the way it happened. Liz met with Kerrigan and asked to have them put in a good word to Dominguez or get her the contract probably. And, um, and Kerrigan just went direct. I think this probably thinks that that garners some favor with Kerrigan. And it doesn't get us one more ounce of help. <laughs> well, maybe once Kerrigan gets at the commission, maybe. 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 I said maybe. Yeah. But it, I don't know what Joe thinks. Yeah. <coughs> but so him hiring Liz Brown for Kerrigan is no different than these three guys being on contract. 